Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. We are working more on my RPG Maker project and let's jump right in with what I got done yesterday. I added the um, pathways or the roads to all of the buildings. Don't worry, I do plan on changing the grass to something else. I just haven't decided what to change it to yet. Or how I'm going to change it to fit the theme. If I was able to instead of having it immediately transition over f between the two tiles I would do something like that to where like the brick slow sl like very slowly fades into the stone I would do that but I don't have any tiles in here that allow that to happen and that would uh, um, require messing with the actual art itself and I don't have the knowledge on how to mess with pixel art at all so it will have to unfortunately be the way it is I know it looks out of place but it is what it is and yeah I mean it works but I wish I could do more with it but I'm not able to because of my limited skills in you know arts arts and whatnot so but I mean I don't care it is what it is <clears throat> last time I recorded was was I think was it Wednesday or Tuesday I don't, I don't remember I got this gate to work. This event is not technically done. Well, I mean, I think it is for this actual event here, which I am going to, um, I need to rename this, um, City bottom gate okay so yeah that one is done and I actually need to copy this because this is now the new master event I think yes so this is now the new master event that I will go off of and then I will change that one as I go. As I use it, I will modify it and make it to where when you go through the door, other stuff happens to make it. How to describe this? Okay, and I, okay, in real life, you open the door. It makes a sound, obviously, like a creaking sound or the obvious sound that it makes when you open it. You in real life then turn around and close that same door. I'm going to do the same thing in my game. I don't want the door to just close by itself. That makes no sense, even for a video game. Having a door closed by itself, if, only if it's not a magical door. If it's a magical door, then having it closed on its own makes sense. If it's a wooden door, a gate, or whatever like that, then yes, you the person or your character in the game has to turn around during that same event process and close said door. Maybe no one wants that in their game. 
but I do because it adds immersion it makes the game feel alive in my opinion and I, I, I just don't like it whenever doors close by themselves I mean I get this it saves time yes but do I really care no I really don't care it's my game and that's how I believe games should be made will other developers implement my same idea no and do I care no do I think they should oh yeah I think they should especially to fuck with speed runners <laughs> seeing people beat video games in five minutes or less oh that will really fuck with them oh yeah that will really fuck with speedrunners big time and I want that I want speedrunning to be I don't care for it I'm, I'm, a, I'm a gamer at heart and in my opinion speedrunning ruins the game so any way I can figure out how to fuck speedrunners run, over I will do it and so should developers if developers see that people are speedrunning they should fix their game so that they can't do it anymore my opinion just saying because to me speedrunning takes the fun out of the game the game that developers put years upon years hours of their lives into making it takes all that fun and heart and soul that they poured into their projects and it just throws it all away so that's my opinion on speedrunning I do not care for it so enough of that rambling nonsense let's get to I guess we will how many houses I got five buildings for the poor district okay hmm okay let's see I guess I will go ahead and decorate or well redecorate the five buildings that I have so far down on the bottom and then work my way up but what I might do after I'm done decorating or again redecorating the five houses is I might go ahead and do the um, surrounding areas as well with the proper um how what I want to the proper tile for that area and then I will decorate that as well the only problem is what do I want to use for that I'm using dirt roads because this is the poor district and then this is the middle district or the middle class and this is the noble district hmm <clears throat> I could decorate all of this in dirt to go with the theme let's see I used what kind of dirt I didn't use any of those I used Did I use that one by chance? Hold on, I wonder. Let me double check. No, I did not. No, okay. I might have used. Okay, I used that one. So, it, I used sand. Okay. Or 
All right, here's what I will do then, actually. Yeah, I will fill all of that in. So now it is proper dirt. And actually, I might. I don't actually want that. I could do that. What if I... Eh, that doesn't really work. I mean, it's basically just sand or grass surrounding sand. What about this one? Nah, doesn't really work. Okay. Um, down here, maybe? No. No. This one. I mean, that could work, maybe? That's no. What is the difference between this and this? Okay, there's no rocks in it or whatever. Okay. Nah. Um. I know, actually, you know what? What I could do is I could do wood for the path. That way it stands out, and then I can do the surrounding areas around this area in um, dirt or something else like, like that, or sand or whatever. Yeah, I can do it in, in, in wood, maybe. We'll see. How does it look up close? Or, you know, like, 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 like this. I mean, that's not bad. I mean, it's not... I mean, that's not bad. Do I have any other tiles that I can use? No, it's not gonna work. I don't have any other wood tiles. I guess I'll just use wood. I mean, I kind of like the dirt idea, which I could... St you know what? Yeah, I'll stick with dirt. Or, I mean, sand. I'll stick with sand. It doesn't matter what I use, honestly. And then what I'll do then is temporarily I will put some snow down. Temporarily. I know it looks weird now with snow down, but honestly it's fine. And then I will do that. And that way it's all blocked in on both sides. And then... I can fill it in with the dirt or sand that I want. Because it is the poor district, it is when you first walk in. So all of the people who barely make it from working where they work at. Or people who are in a sense homeless, but they still live in like, you know, run down homes or whatever they live down here <clears throat> so yeah and then I can probably fill it in actually I can probably do this oh why did it do th oh I didn't fill it in a uh, okay hold on now um, I didn't fill it in in the right area. Well, fudge and nuggets. I can fix that real quick. There we go. Alright, so save this and then take this. And then fill it in. 
I mean, that, uh, no, not that one. This is the same thing, basically. What if I reversed it? And then... Yeah, it looks better. Okay. Yeah, that looks better. That looks better. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. That looks better. And then it has like a grassy edge to it. No, we don't want that. Yeah, we don't want that. Yeah, that looks better. So this will be the poor district. Okay. And... So... could do actually hold on now instead of having so this is a path right here the brick that's a path so what I could then do is I can separate it with a fence maybe God, I hate how I right click and it does not do what I want it to do. Why have they not fixed that fucking bug yet? I swear. Okay, I need to fix down there as well, which is not a big deal. I need to do this real quick and then zoom in. zoom in again I may not use this on this map I mean I might I don't know yet actually I might not if I do it will be part of um, something bigger like an event or something. Okay, put the towers down. Save. Well, technically, save it. Because pressing Control S or up here does not actually save the, the program. Because, yes. Alright, so we have that now. Because it is the poor district, it's when you first come in. I need to have a stables too because there's going to be horses and whatnot as well. So. Of course, it will be a non essential building, so I won't make the interior for it. Not until I'm actually done with all of the essential buildings. Okay. <clears throat> do I want trees? Or do I want to add more... More stuff to it? Actually, no. I know what I could do, actually. This is the poor district. So instead of having proper homes... This is the poor district. You know what? I just got an idea. These five buildings down here, they're not homes. They're small businesses.
they are small, like a little, like a store, a stables, um, a guardhouse, which is the very first one. We don't even have the homes at all put down. And I'm looking at the homes right now in the tile sets. Yeah, I love that idea. Instead of... Yeah. And there's really no need for me to... Yeah, so yeah, the, this is the home right here. The tents are the homes, and there's no need for me to make make interiors for them because that would be too many interiors to deal with. And plus, who wants to see inside of a a poor man's home, or uh, who wants to see inside of a tent? There's not really much there. So, and do I even have... I mean, I do have that for the outside. But I don't think I have the interior for a tent. Or do I? I don't have the interior for a tent. So, yeah, I, I cannot make the interior at all. I don't have the proper tile set for that whatsoever. The proper tile set is placed on the outside tile set, which is right here. They put it in the wrong area. See? It is right there. So, I cannot make interior maps for, for tents because it's on the wrong tile set. And it's been that way since VX Ace, I believe. Let me check, hold on. Thank God I have this installed still. Now I'm gonna get an error saying, oh, this is wrong, or whatever, we gotta do this, we gotta do that. Okay, it shouldn't take this damn long to synchronize something. Good God, dude. Seriously. Cancel. Launch. Launching. Launching. Hey, Steam, what's wrong, buddy? Come on now. Hey, Gabe, I think something's wrong with Steam. Alright, so now. Yeah, here's the tent right, right here, where the mouse is right now. First alert, Chief Meteorologist Ron Hurst. A new station alert has arrived for your area. <sighs> okay. Yeah, so the tent is on the outside tile map. Let's go in, wrong one. Um, let's go into the tile sets for interior. So here's the tent over here where the mouse is on the le left side. And the database tile sets. Oh, this one has one. So I could do it here if I wanted to, but now let's compare to this one. Inside. This one. Oh, is that one right there? No, I don't think it is. Hold on, let me check. Let me check them real quick. Um, edits. Inside. It's going to look weird, I know. I know it looks weird. Again, I'm going to repeat. I know it looks weird. Again, I know it looks weird. I will change it back. I repeat. I will change it back. No, that is not for a tent at all. That is for a desert tile. Because it says down on the bottom left. Desert. So I do not have a tent interior. On 
this program. Why they left it out is beyond me. So there's no point in in doing that. So now edit. I wanna I wonder. I mean it would be an interesting dungeon. It would be one interesting dungeon. But it looks okay. I'm I'm even more curious now. I just got rid of the roads altogether. What in the fudge, dude? What did it put down? Really, trees? Okay. <laughs> I still want to make a game where everything's just a buggy mess. I really do. <laughs> I really do. Everything is just one giant buggy mess. I really want to do that. And it's buggy mess on purpose. Like that is the whole point of the game. And in order to proceed you have to find the right bug. Or make the right bug happen to progress in the game. That would be fun. <clears throat> Have fun, speedrunners. <laughs> Every time you play the game, oh, here we go. Here we go. You have to have the right bug happen to proceed in the game. And every time you play the game, it's random. So it's a roguelike, buggy mess of a game. But it's buggy of a mess of a game intentionally. Because why the hell not? Everyone hates it whenever a game is buggy. But this one is buggy on purpose. Because that's the whole point. Oh dude, I want to play something like that so bad. I would love that. Oh my god. I would love that. And I, Oh my. Oh my. Yeah, I would love that. Mm-hmm. Can a can a studio get on that right now? Oh yeah, how about um like EA? <laughs> EA with their sports games. How about that? We grand. Cause they're the same they're the same shit over and over again. <laughs> you want Michael Jordan on your team? Well you gotta pay a thousand bucks to Game for Michael Jordan. Are you want LeBron James? Give us a thousand bucks for a chance at LeBron James. Fuck you, EA. Fuck you. <laughs> I love your games, but your sports ones are trash. <laughs> Make Bioware great again. Xbox, buy Bioware, please. I'm begging you. Buy out Bioware and take um, Mass Effect and Dragon Age and make them both great again. Or house Gabe from Steam. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> He'll make them both great again, surely. And EA can go rot in hell. <laughs> Same for Activision and Ubisoft. <laughs> I mean, I know I know Activision's owned by Microsoft, but honestly, I don't have hopes for Activision. I mean, I, 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 mean, I do, but I don't at the same time. Because there's really nothing I want to play from them besides Call of Duty. That's all they do. 23 studios is nothing but Call of Duty all all the time. So until that changes, I have no hope for them. Alright, so let's see here. I need to redecorate these, these buildings. But I want to put down some some tents. Because these are, this is the homeless camp. The homeless camp. <laughs> 
Well, it's not really a homeless camp, but, you know. I also want to put down fencing around there. <laughs> I'm making a tent city. <laughs> I'll piss some people off, I'm sure. But I don't give a fuck. It's my game. <laughs> Alright, so those are done now. There's no point in even do anything with those. We have our houses now. We're done. Nice. Time to end the recording. Oh, okay, I'm kidding. That was a good recording session. Bye, guys. <laughs> I'll see you next week. Mark, I'll see you next month when I'm doing this map. Alright, save it. Put one more down. Why not? It won't hurt. Save it again because yes. Alright, so the housing is done. The tents are put down. We have we have a tent city. Perfect. I might have put down too many tents, but honestly, it is a city. Like, I mean, it is a city for a reason. So, yeah, there might be too many tents. But at least there's not homeless. Because I could do homeless, I wonder. I wonder if I could do homeless or not. Hold on, I'm curious. Randomize. 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 Will it even give me someone who looks poor? I don't think it will. Yeah, you look poor enough. Not. None of these people look poor. Um, hold on. I wonder. Clothing. Yeah, none of them look poor. <laughs> um, this is going to be fun. None of them look poor. Can I do it? Oh. I mean, I could have them in their underwear. <laughs> I'll be poor then. <laughs> uh, let's see here. Now we need to decor the buildings. This one will be, I think, the stables. So this will be a non-essential building. So there's no point in making an interior. So I need to take wood and it is a wooden building. I need an opening Right there. No, I did not want to hit that one. I need windows because it is a building. Son of a biscuit. Yeah, that kind of works, I guess. All right, so up one more as well. All right, so there's the windows. And then I 
and a vent, sh a vent shaft for all the crap that comes out of the building. And then we need a chimney for whenever it gets cold. Nice. And the stables is made. We're not. I'm not gonna bother with making an interior map until basically the rest of the game is done. Because if I run, if I do use all 2,000 maps, which I may or may not, who knows? <clears throat> I don't want to make maps that are unnecessary to the game. And a stables for now is in a sense not necessary to the game because it's where horses are are stored and there's really no point in going in there unless I put like maybe like an item in there or something or a chest but I don't really see a reason to put anything in there so for now it's just like it's not a necessary map to make or interior to make at all. I still might do it, don't, don't get me wrong, but I don't see a reason to. And, and they're probably thinking in the comments or put in the comments, but you have 2,000 maps to work with. I know I do. But I might use all of them. Which I highly doubt I would, but let's say I do. Is putting in a horse stable really worth it? I mean, yeah, I could make it and I could put it over here on this map. But is it still worth doing? Just for one extra item? Maybe two? I don't think so. Now if I was not doing this method right here, I would use up all 2,000 maps very quickly. Very quickly. So I still might do it, but I more than likely won't because it's just going to be one more item I put in there. I can put that same one more item somewhere else. And if I do put something in there, it'll be a chest. I already have my idea for what I want that system to be as. And you guys are not going to like it, trust me. Trust me, no one's gonna like my idea for for treasure chests. Just saying that now. Especially the loot system for my game. No one's going to like it. You're gonna think it's a cool idea. But when they find out that, oh, this is the only way to actually make it work because of reasons like limitations on RPG Maker or coding reasons or whatever yeah it's gonna be a very tedious system on how you get items from enemies and no one's gonna like it trust me even I don't like it if I knew a better way to do it I would do it that way, but I don't. And it's unfortunate, but actually I wonder. I'm not gonna use my PC, but I wonder, do I have an image of it on my Facebook? I might, I might. Oh, uh, with Facebook going off. Go away, no one cares. Go away, no one cares. Um, I want face boobs. Or boob face. Hey. If I have a picture of it, I will have to show you guys my... 
my idea. Is this it right here? No, that's um, S V X Aces coding. I don't have a picture of the event. Unfortunately, I thought I did, but I don't. Oh well, it is what it is. Unless this is. No, I don't have a picture of the event. Oh well, I thought I did. Not a big deal. All right, so we got one, one building done, and I used air quotes for that because it may or may not be done. We'll see. Who knows? So now we got four more to go, and we got decoration to go. So, so we're not going to consider this sand. This is just dirt. So let's see here. If I put down grass, what happens? Okay, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. So I can put down spots of grass in certain areas and then put trees down as well. That's what I want. So even though it's considered s sand, it's actually not sand because we can do this with it. I can do this with it and put it on trees. Hell yeah. Okay, so this building. Um no actually I want this one first. This one is the is the um the guard house. So the guard house, the guard house, the guard. I actually might leave this one as is. Yeah. I may not though, who knows. Um actually no, I won't. Crap on a cracker. This is the guardhouse. This is the guardhouse. Okay. A guardhouse Do I have, do I have, I do, I do, I do, I do. Perfection, okay. We'll have that up there. I don't know if I can have NPCs use the stairs or not on their own. Not without an event, but even still, just having it up there, it makes sense. It makes total sense. Actually, actually, let's have um, a double staircase because of reasons. Um, let's have I would put, honestly, yeah, hold on. I will put, whoops, it's not the right one. All right, so that is, that is done now. Cool, okay. Um. That is not an antenna. I'm sorry, but that is not an antenna. 
if you want to consider that an antenna, put it in a modern day tile set, not the medieval tile set. They did not have TV back in medieval times. I'm sorry. And if they did, then I'm calling aliens. Because aliens. Um. What is that right here? Nah, okay. Actually, yeah, no, that would work. Oh, I need a doorway. I need a doorway right there. We're gonna save it. We're gonna make it, make sure it saves. Actually, we're gonna save properly. My mistake. We're gonna save properly. Sign post. Another sign post. <clears throat> and actually, this this is the the city. So we will do this as well for every building down here, maybe up top further as well. Who knows? No, that's the wrong one. Actually, hold on. No, actually, no, that one. No, that works. Yeah, no, no. Eh, where is it at? Over here. Okay. Yeah, we'll do this. That's too close together. Yeah, no, that's too close together. We'll, we'll do that. And then I need a signpost here. Cool. Actually, no. I'll put a sign. Yeah, yeah. I'll put that one. So this is the fort, or the guard house, I mean. Now it needs windows. Let's do these ones. Why not? One here, one right there, and then one right there. Perfect. The next one will be <coughs> a store. Yeah. So hold on. Stables, guard. Um. Tables, guardhouse. What else? Um, trying to think of what else might be 
down here to see the um Hmm. I know what I'll do. I know what I will do, actually. This will be the, um, ah, my wrist is hurting. Why? Good Lord. Two of those. One, two, and three. Perfect. Okay. So this will be where the guards eat. This will actually be where everyone eats for even defer. Yeah. This will be the um the inn. some windows. Alright. Just got two more to go. Okay, so... That was the inn. Over here will be the um the armory. So on right here.
and then maybe this roof that kind of works yeah and then I'll put this kind of a biscuit this one there and then this one like right there and it is an armory or like yeah so I need that now for the flag Now that's like a prison window. I remember we'll get these windows. They're only opened whenever. Okay, save this and then do this to actually save it. <coughs> Alright, so now we got. <coughs> actually, no, I want to do one more thing. Um, <coughs> I will do that so I know. Okay. Let's see. This will be no, not that tile. Okay, so everyone sleeps here. This will be where everyone eats. Okay. It doesn't really work with that roof. Okay, um <coughs> what about the other roof? Why not? That kinda works. I don't know if you guys can hear that popping, but that's my wrists popping. And I always do that no matter what I do. We've been doing that for several years now. God, that one area on my hand is just, even with the Damn, dude, that hurts. Mm.
It's what I get for working on this yesterday at a coffee shop on a very, very bad table. <laughs> Some of my wrist hurts when I'm doing this, which is not good. I mean, it's not my whole wrist. It's like... It's the part of the wrist that rests on the table. Whenever you're using a mouse or, you know, or a keyboard. Man, if... Oh, man. So even with a um, ergonomic wrist pad, it is just sore as all heck. doorway windows I will do let's do these ones son of a biscuit after I'm done decorating this building and then drawing the fence I am going to um, put a cut in the video because I am starting to fall asleep I got home earlier after going out and getting some food had Golden Corral, and now I'm starting to fall asleep. So, yeah. Right, so, that one is done. Now, for the fencing. Let's see if this works. I'm curious. Well, it. Excuse me. It didn't fuck up. Nice, dude. Okay, then. do what I want it to do there we go yeah I know that is actually what I want right there hell yeah dude it's connect connected to there now how did I do that hold on I shift clicked okay that's what I want yeah, that's what I want right there. Okay, hold on now. Yeah, that's what I want. And then... Thank God for the square tool is all I'm going to say because if I didn't have it I would be screwing up so badly right now. Do I want to mimic down here? I kind of do actually.
Yeah, I kind of do. No. Guard here, guard here, and then a gate here to get up. Perfect. So that will work. Nice. Okay, so then not do it over there yeah it may not do it over here Is this part of the reason why? Hold on. Is that part of it? No, it's not. It's not wanting to cooperate with me. Did it over on this side, but it won't do it on this side, which is, which is weird. <clears throat> do I need to do a different layer? What layer is this one on? I'm curious. Hold on. Is that part of it? Okay, so layer two?
that's not what I wanted. Well, if I do this, then nope, that's not gonna work. Huh? I don't know why it's not doing it. That's so weird. Yeah, no, it's working fine over here. Oh, is that why? Hold on. Is that part of, hold on, is that part of why? No. It is, okay. Depending on where you click. That's interesting. That, okay. So if I click over here and I do this, it does that. If I click over here and then I do this. That's interesting. I had no idea about that at all, honestly. That is very interesting. That's why I don't really mess with fencing because it is so borked and they need to make it easier to use. <laughs> They really need to make it easier to use versus how it is now, but all right, so the fencing is done, like I said earlier, I am going to call it good for now. This video may not be uploaded tonight. We'll see, but anyways. If you enjoyed the video, feel free to subscribe, like, and of course, hit the bell for more. And I will see you guys next time. Have a wonderful day.